wisely. Just days ago, she spoke of the incredible experience of watching her late father's story come to life on film at the Golden Globes. But earlier today, the only child of Elvis was rushed to hospital after collapsing at her Los Angeles home and died within hours. She was 54. She was famous from the moment she was born. The only child of mother died of a heart attack, a memory that would haunt her forever. Elvis Presley died today. He was 42. Apparently it was a heart attack. His body was in the house for three days and there was something very oddly comforting about that which made it not necessarily real for me um, as I stayed in there with it almost the whole time. She became sole heir to the Graceland estate, but worked closely with her mother, protecting the legacy of her father. How tough did you have to be? ...develop a good thick skin, which sometimes I've had and sometimes I don't have. You're always going to get that, well, you would never, unless you were his daughter anyway, and blah, 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 whatever. So it, it's really nice to be... work and that's really what I'm in it for. She even duetted with her famous father. And as her young man died. Her personal life often made headlines. In 1994 she married Michael Jackson, a wedding that fused the families of the King of Rock and the King of Pop. I fell into this whole you poor sweet misunderstood thing, I'm gonna save you, you know, I, I fell into that. I fell in love with him, I did. I'm I, I, In love? Yes, I fell in love at the time. They divorced two years later before a brief marriage to actor Nicolas Cage. She then married musician Michael Lockwood with whom she had twins in 2008. But it was her first marriage to Danny Keogh that proved pivotal today. It was he who performed CPR on his ex-wife after he returned home from dropping her twins at school to find her unresponsive. Danny and Lisa Marie had two children of their own, actress Riley Keogh and a son Ben, who died by suicide two years ago. But recently there had been happier times. Last June, the family put their handprints in the cement on Hollywood Boulevard. It's a very special moment for all of us. We feel incredibly honoured. So thank you. And then two nights ago, Lisa Marie joined her mother at the Golden Globes to cheer on Baz Luhrmann's movie about her father, which earned star Austin Butler a Best Actor award. Hey Lisa, how are you? I just, I just thought what I thought of on you. Her mother Priscilla raced to the hospital after her daughter's heart attack and was by her side when she died, saying in a statement, she was the most passionate, strong and loving woman I have ever known. Lisa Marie Presley was 54. Angela Bishop for 10 News First. A cyclist has died after...